Now at six, new technology is helping the Milwaukee Police Department make dramatic improvements in 911 call response times. But police data shows it's taking longer on average for officers to arrive on scene. Ben Jordan goes in depth on why these trends are going in the opposite directions. Every 911 call made in the city of Milwaukee is answered here at Police District 3 on the north side. More than a year after a new 911 system was put into place, the department is answering calls much quicker and leaving far fewer callers on hold. Inside Milwaukee Police Department's 911 Communication Center, dozens of workers called telecommunicators are assigned to one important duty. 911, Milwaukee Police, Operator 77, where is your emergency? Answer a staggering number of emergency calls. Did you need police, medical, or fire department? MPD data shows about 50,000 911 calls are made each month. They are in constant contact with the officers on the street. Captain Michelle Haywood knows the stakes often couldn't be higher on the other end of the line. It could be a matter of life and death. 911 systems were originally designed for landlines, but now that a majority of people use cell phones, police departments across the country are upgrading to what's called next generation 911 technology. The system Milwaukee purchased in the spring of 2021 immediately brings a cell phone caller's location up on the dispatcher's computer via GPS. Captain Haywood says it allows telecommunicators to spend less time taking down information, and police say that ultimately should allow officers to get to the scene 30 to 40 seconds faster. They get more accurate information, especially as it pertains to the cell phone towers and the caller's information of where they're possibly located at to get them the service that they need quicker. The National Emergency Number Association sets standards for police departments to meet. The main criteria is 95% of all 911 calls should be answered within 20 seconds. MPD data shows that was met just 66% of the time last July, but the department has gradually made progress as it adjusts to the new system. In February, about 90% of 911 calls were answered within that time frame. We have two distinct roles here. Once the dispatchers who speak directly with 911 callers enter the emergency into the system, that information immediately goes to other dispatchers who talk to officers at the nearest police district. But new MPD data shows it's taking officers 70 seconds longer to respond to those scenes than it did last year when 911 call answer times weren't as quick. Why do you believe that's the case? I think um, it has changed. Obviously, we have had um, members leaving the department through attrition, and we have had to replace them. So at times, there are less staff on the floor, so that has an effect on it. Police say the average on-scene response for a 911 call takes 18 minutes and 21 seconds in Milwaukee. But the highest priority calls, which could include critical incidents like officer-involved shootings, take an average of 4 minutes and 44 seconds for officers to arrive. The next priority category, which includes life-threatening incidents, takes about 10 and a half minutes for police to make it on scene. What is MPD doing to get these response times down? We're doing everything that we can. Obviously, we are making sure as far as the telecommunicators and the dispatchers here are getting the calls out in a timely manner. And we're also monitoring the calls for service, not only just for one particular district, but citywide. MPD says it isn't just fewer sworn officers creating a delay in response times. An increase in crime and demands for police services is also a big factor. Reporting outside of District 3, Ben Jordan, TMJ4 News.